All right, guys. I got another Watch Gang watch. Now, um, I know it's Watch Gang, but I don't actually know whether or not it's just my normal subscription <clears throat> or if it is uh, one of the wheels. I've been so addicted to them lately that I have a bunch of them. I, I, actually, I'll just show a picture right here. This is what I got to open. So, who knows? Uh, this could be my, my monthly normal one. If I don't recognize it, then that's what it'll be. But either way, it'll be a surprise. There's so many, I haven't even bothered to try and line up the uh, the shipping numbers. <clears throat> so we'll find out. Wow, what is this? This thing looks awesome. I have no idea what this is. Okay, I think this is for the month of... Uh... Oh, this is January. There you go. Right there. January 2021. Oh, great. Oh, I'm going to... Oh. I think I'm going to be excited. I really want a new dive watch. This is going to look awesome. I have no idea what this is. Sweet. Oh, this is going to be so cool. I'm excited. All right, so nice box. Carrying bag. Okay, it's kind of cool. All right, let's put that to the side. And this data purchase watch gang. Cool. <clears throat> All right. Put that up there. Let's open this up. Oh, this is gonna be really cool. I can already tell. I'm pretty excited. This is a cool little bag. I, I, I gotta admit, it's actually quite cool. Oh, this is gonna be so awesome. Oh my God, what is this? Damn, this is so nice. Look at this, this is cool. Oh, man, what is this? Well, I'm sure there's a fancy name for it, but it's the uh, Aquinas. God, this thing is excellent. Man. All right. I'm going to do a little bit of research on this, <clears throat> on this company, and I'll play a video if I can. Otherwise, uh, I'll get right back into the review. The Aquinas story begins the spring of 2019 in New York with its very first collection, the Amersius, a professional dive watch designated for the deep, was first introduced. Okay. Can you do it without the accent? <sighs> okay, fine. This new innovative watch line was brought to the seas of Cebu, Philippines, for intensive testing and to showcase the quality of the new manufacturer. In early 2020, Aquinas captured the interest of Kudita Labs. As an industry incubator, Aquinas Watch Company was taken under its wing and the marquee was evolved into a successful diver watch brand. With their expertise and experience, Aquinas boasts of excellent quality and orological legitimacy. The Aquinas community is not just composed of divers who love watches or watchmakers who love diving. They are both, and with the highest reverence for the ocean, not just as a part of the world we live in, but as a vital link that connects us to nature. Aquinas designs their timepieces with the help of industry leaders and watch enthusiasts. From the orologist table in New York and Switzerland oh to the seas of Cebu, Philippines, where their first watches were tested, Aquinas is committed to bringing you quality dive watches worth a diver's trust. All right, guys. So now you have a little bit of history uh, about this company. Uh, it's actually, it's a very, very new company. And um, I, I have to say, I really like their watches. I've looked at a couple of their watches uh, on their on their website. I'll put a few of them up there on the right, right here, as I'm trying to pull off these uh, stickers and stuff. And they had several, several different um, watches. And I, I actually really liked all of them. Some of them are a little bit too dished for me. So, um, you know, not entirely my style, but this one definitely is, right? I mean, I really like the uh, um, Coke bottle design it's a sort of the coke uh let's see who else had that was that rolex i think that had that you know i'm just gonna leave this on it's gonna take me too long to get it off but um very nice watch i mean i i gosh i really like this watch i mean look at this this watch is gorgeous 
This thing looks spectacular. Um, the first thing I'm going to mention, just because it's, uh, you know, I, I want to set the time. Let me clean this up. It, um, it has a uh, screw-down crown. Fantastic. And even when it's fully screwed down, the logo is perfectly seated, which, you know, there's a lot of people that are, you know, we joke kind of OCD, that this is a big deal to them. And, and even the uh, the name is properly seated uh, on, on the back and, and lined up. So I mean, they did a great job with this, really. And so I actually took the, uh, the watch back off, uh, the case back off, and um, I was able to see that uh, when I was removing it, it, it's a uh, fine threaded it's not coarse and it really came off it was it was really smooth i was just really impressed the uh, the build quality of this watch is just really spectacular um you know what? let me put this back the uh the bezel pretty fantastic you know the the coke bottle design it's reminiscent of the uh, uh the rolex uh coke coke or pepsi i'm sorry not coke um, it's, it's reminiscent of the Pepsi style. Um, so really cool. I, I just, I get a kick out of it. I, man, I've got so many watches. What am I going to do? Am I going to keep this one too? Anyways. Yeah. So screw down crown. I really like that. Um, you know, this gets sometimes some negative comments, but it's, it's very important. People realize that, um, screw down crowns are superior in every way to the normal pushing crowns now there's a lot of nice watches that don't have a screw down crown but look the screw down crown is done on purpose right it's it's not just uh it it really does help water resistance a lot of people don't realize it but you know you got a gasket in here and one on the shaft you know inside the shaft tube so it completely seals uh sometimes with the, uh, the non-screw down crowns, you have a seal on the inside of the crown tube as well, and it still seals, but you're still getting water in here, right? Now, when this is, if you pull it out, you're still getting water inside the crown, and it can make its way in there at some point. Um, some of them just have it like right at the top, so when it's closed, it's sealed, and when you pop it open, then it goes in, right? And people don't realize that, that most watches are actually like that. Um, you know, especially all these like these older ones, style like that you know when you pop that open even though they've got a crown tube and it says it's water resistant to i don't know whatever what does it say whatever you know there's some water resistance it's it's not um which one does this say water resistant like even this right you know you pop that out that's water's eventually going to get in there uh i'm jumping all over okay so this bezel 120 clicks this is a true diver's watch now it is not it's not as heavy duty as this one this RGMT with the, uh, the helium valve, uh, but it is still a good diver's watch. This is a 200 meter, and you know I'll put the the picture up here so you can see. 200 meters is is fantastic. So that is perfect for swimming, snorkeling, and uh, scuba diving. Right, 200 meters down, and I've talked about this before. That is. Um, that is twice what what is that about twice the length of a football field so that's that that's pretty deep right if you were in if you were in florida um there's pretty much very few areas that you would be snorkeling that you would go below this at 200 meters i mean that that would take you right down to some of the wrecks um you know near near the keys uh that's you would have no problems with this uh this watch would be absolutely fantastic uh, I, I love the, the the chrome case, very high quality. I and I really can't emphasize that enough. I, it's three sixteen stainless steel, uh, but it's it's very finely polished, and and I love the engraved case back. There's this there's a nice seal in there. Um, I, I greased it. It's it's really good. Oh, God, I guess I'm gonna keep this one. Damn it. The uh, uh, the waves on the inside are sort of reminiscent of the new. Uh, Omega, th the newer version of the Omega Seamaster, and I actually have a very old Seamaster in 1963 in perfect condition that I'll probably uh, show show the channel at some point, but I just haven't bothered to put it on. Uh, but I love the logo, right? It's a diver mask with the um, the snorkel and everything on it. Uh, they got the name here on the back, on the crown, on the face, just really fantastic and and solid link. 
Uh, absolutely solid link bracelet. I mean, it, it really is. It's it's super nice. Uh, I don't really have an example because I hate them so much. But uh, I don't have an example of a stamped and rolled bracelet. But just I cannot stand those. I mean, I cannot tell you enough. I I cannot stand stamped and rolled bracelets. Um, so very very happy to see that this one is uh, is solid link. Um, let's see, what else can I talk about? The, the loom is good. I'm going to take care of that right now because I, I want to see that. Uh, give me a minute. Turn the lights off and see what this looks like. That is fantastic. Look at that. That is a true, that is a true diver loom. Love it. All right, now let's let's start looking at some of the sizes. Now, this watch I've got here is really a behemoth, but I like it. I mean, you can see there's definitely a, a size difference, but um, let's look at this because I think it's a little bit more modest of, of a size. I'm gonna say 44. 42, okay. That's a nice, good size without it being ridiculous. And uh, 20 for the lug. And the depth is, I'm gonna say 13, 13. So this is, this is a really, really nice watch. I really did well on this uh, January watch gang. Now, I think that they've given some of these away in the past um, during other months, but you know what? I wasn't part of it. This is my third month in watch gang and I'm, very pleased with this. Uh, I think if I did the math correctly, I pay about $117 per watch shipped. And while I wouldn't necessarily have looked for this watch because I didn't know it existed, I've now learned a little bit about this watch uh, and this company, and, and, and I'm, I, I certainly appreciate it. Um, the watch MSRP, according to the tag that it came with, a uh, nice, nice little tag, the tag says that it's $295 and I've confirmed it on the website. So you can see uh, that is the current MSRP also. And even still, that is quite a good, good deal for a full price for a good dive watch. Now, I, went, I always look for these watches whenever I get anything from Watch Gang. I always look to see if I can find it in other places. And I could not find it anywhere. Um, it isn't really being sold anywhere else so and and most of the watches that this company had for sale were out of stock now it is a smaller company so their production is limited and with covid going on it doesn't surprise me that they don't have any so this kind of works out nice um i've gotten a watch that uh is hard for others to get and that isn't necessarily available i really like it and i definitely think it's worth 117 dollars that i paid I really can't compare it to anything other than the MSRP because there are no other ones for sale. There was really only one other watch by Aquinas that was for sale on eBay and it was uh, for like 190 or something dollars. So, um, you know what, let's do the weight. I forgot to do that. I always like to do that. Just so you can kind of get a good idea. Again, I'll do it in grams for my European and Canadian friends. And I think pretty much everyone else other than the United States. <laughs> All right, uh, 167 grams. So nice weight, not crazy. <laughs> Certainly not like like this beast. Uh, let's see, what else can I can I talk about it? It it just it it really has a really nice quality feel. I mean, I really like this. It's a you know the typical clasp like that. Um, doesn't have any extra pop out for uh for a wetsuit but it is still nice you know if you're going to do some some scuba diving uh that doesn't really necessarily require a heavy wetsuit or something like this is this this is perfect um or snorkeling i mean this is a this is really a snorkeler's watch in my opinion you're you'll take this all over the caribbean uh florida keys this is perfect so well hopefully you enjoyed this uh this video uh, again i got this from watch gang 
Um, please leave your comments below. Discuss uh, anything that you think about this watch. Do you like it? Do you think I got a good deal? Do you like the look? Um, if you enjoy this video, please leave a like. And uh, if you want to see more, uh, please subscribe. Thank you very much.